Shepard, I don't like this. I should be the one going in. I know I said to act the angry Krogan, Rex. That was just good old-fashioned Krogan hot air. If it had been real, they'd be dead. Hey, maybe when this is over, you and I can go toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Just for fun. Shepard here almost did. She ever tell you about our little chat on Vermeer? You could say we had a disagreement. Good times. <laughs> That's one way to put it. Who tipped you off about the females here? Sorry, Shepard, but they're listening to every word we say. I prefer my Salarian liver served raw. <laughs> This Krogan has a unique style of communication. He's an acquired taste. Back on the Normandy, you said Reapers were sighted on Tachanka. Clans Jorgal and Ravador sighted a few landing parties. The Reapers are up to something. Tuchunka may be a pile of radioactive rubble, but it's our pile. And we'll fight the last Krogan to keep it that way. This is my kind of Krogan. You're one of Shepard's new recruits, huh? Hang on, kid. It's a hell of a ride. What do you know about these females? They weren't fertile, so we used them as decoys to draw off enemies from the ones who were. But Malin's experiments changed that. These damn piejacks stole them right out from under us. That's a pretty brutal way to treat your women, Rex. The females suggested it. We've had to make a lot of tough choices to ensure we don't all die off. A harsh but necessary decision. It's just one more thing that'll get better when the genophage is cured. Are the Krogan ready to fight the Reapers? Ever since Sovereign showed up, I figured this day would come. My people have spent too much time selling ourselves out as mercenaries. Now we can get back to doing what Krogan do best. Saving everyone else from giant monsters. I assume you're referring to the Rachni Wars. Well, it sure wasn't synthetics that stopped them. Besides, your kind might have helped them. Been good talking to you again, Rex. It'll be even better when we have a few Solarians for lunch.